are back. This is Hyper RPG broadcasting from Evergreen Tabletop Expo 2016. I am here with the three finalists of the Lucy Award nomination. So one of these people was, actually there's two awards, but <laughs> one of these people are gonna actually have their board game published. The, right? No, no, I don't think so. so. <laughs> this is a, this oh, is three, actually. That, that would be amazing. That would be amazing and awesome. <laughs> okay. We hope that all three of these games get published. Absolutely. But, but the Lucy Award is a designer-centric award. Right. It's a, an award by peers mm -hmm. that is given out by the designers that came and did the round robin. Right. But it's really design-centric. There isn't a publisher. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. But Thank you for the clarification. Year. There are publishers on the live tweet. We are and, looking. And, we, and you guys will be kind of like nominated and judged and accepted and approved of by published people. That's yeah. true. Yeah, there you anyway, go. Anyway, so we have be better than that. Pizza Pronto. Yep, I'm Rob Kramer. Rob Kramer. And we have Word Domination. Word Domination. Word Domination and Dice of Crowns um, by Jeff, Jeff Beck. Beck and, and Brandon Roulette. Brandon Roulette. So um, I have a few questions. Are you guys at the edge of your seat right now? Yeah. Well, these chairs are... They're kind of wonky, so yeah, because I, I try yeah. to stay on they, the edge of my seat. Up and like anyway, so you have to stay at yeah, the edge of your seat. That's really the only okay. option. Yeah. And there were some tough questions. Anything that threw you guys off? Um, you know, they asked a few, a few questions about. You know, it was like that tough job interview, like, right. what are you not good at? Oh my goodness. You know, it was those kinds of questions, <laughs> like, this is terrible, terrible about your game. Right. Well, let me tell you. you Whoa. <laughs> so th those, those threw me for a loop a little bit. But you were dressed as an evil villain, so were you dishonest? Of course, I lied. Okay. <laughs> All right. thing. Nice. I actually had nothing to do with this game. Okay. I, I beat it off a little eight-year-old kid on my uh -huh. way into the conference. Yeah. Awesome. Well, well played, sir. Well played. Yeah, well. Yeah. Um, so, thank you for correcting my mistake. Sure. It sounds like... All you guys have plans to at least kickstart or self-publish or that kind of thing, right? Yep. Um, yeah, we're not going to give up on our, our little game. Yeah, yeah, one way or the other. I think we've, we've you know we've made it this far, so right. that much effort, you know, and that we've gotten into this part of the competition. It's like that sort of validation that, yep, you know, this is a good idea. Let's there's, go for it. Something here. Yeah. yeah. You all get to put the little stamp of Lucy on your game now, right? Yeah. At the very least. So anybody in the chat room, yeah, def no, definitely a reason to support uh, these creators and look out for their games on the interwebs mm -hmm. so yes. they can, you know, be the ones that help will it into existence, right? <laughs> yes. Um, anything you want to say? Last words? I'm uh, excited to find out who wins so we can go and play some games. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Amen. Awesome. I also want to say that uh, everybody else, even the, these three plus the others that were there at the table, I had a really great time just meeting the other yeah. designers. Yeah. They were all super cool. They all had interesting ideas. All the games were so different. Uh, and I really enjoyed just kind of hanging out in those mm -hmm. little low periods where we wait for people to come up and say, hey, you want to hear about my game? So yeah. I enjoyed yeah. every bit of it. I, so you guys are great. Yeah. And I would say, you know, in addition, I mean, it's the entire community. The game right. community yeah. is super supportive. Like, my game would be nothing if it wasn't for all the people that gave me fantastic feedback and helped Absolutely. me come up with ideas. So, so I appreciate so many people. For yeah. yeah, because you also do uh, a podcast. So have they been kind of... Um, tracking your progress on your way Actually, to the Olympics of board games uh, or whatever. So my listeners probably don't know that I design games because oh. mostly I'm interviewing other designers. Interesting. So, so might you might Yeah, you might have some interesting news <laughs> to take I'm going to have to interview home. myself at some ah, future episode. I understand. That I sounds understand. like a lot of fun. Yeah. Yeah, so, fun. Uh, what do you guys think of Evergreen Tabletop Expo? I it's like awesome. it. I've had a good time so How far. long do you think I can draw out the, the news before it's <laughs> finally about a second make it too long. Happen. That's how long you can I draw I actually it. heard there are two awards. Yes, right? there are two awards. That's a great segue. So, uh, the first award is actually a People's Choice Award, right. and it's basically based on just the random people that show up at the expo mm -hmm. and try out your games and listen to your pitches, and they all voted on what they thought the most interesting and best design was. Mm -hmm. uh, and if you're ready, I can announce that. Yeah, let's do it, let's do it. So the winner of that is Dice of Crowns. Woo! Whoa! So, Brandon, you win a fancy trophy and you win a $50 gift certificate from the Game right. Crafter, who is our sponsor. Nice. Excellent. Congratulations. Excellent. Well, then I will put this here. There you go. Well done. Excellent. Well earned. <laughs> crown on the crown. And the second award is the Design Award, which, again, started with contestants submitting online, submitting rules and videos, going through an additional... Uh, uh, a weeding process, right. then coming up with eight final contestants, which came here at EDX, 
down to you three, which got to present to a panel of pro designers. Right. And, and the winner of that contest is Word Domination. Yeah. Unbelievable! Yeah. And you also get a uh, gift certificate to you. Well done. Well done. Wow. That's right. I want to wow. thank you guys very much for coming and participating and putting up with the grilling of the judges and everything. You've been great sports and great. a lot of fun to work it's with. It's been super fun. Yeah, I've had a really good time. Awesome. Um, winners, do you have any final remarks? <laughs> Wow, I am just super excited. I've been working on Word Domination for a little while, and it's just super gratifying to have this kind of feedback. Yeah, this is like a real legit right, award, yeah, dude. Nice. Put that on your wall. You know, I took a few days off to come to this event, and I'm going to go back to work and be like, see, it was all worth it. Yes, <laughs> yes. I can't do it. I'm legit. And uh, People's Choice Award winner. Uh, I think it's fantastic. It's great. I'm really excited. I talked to a lot of people this weekend, so apparently some of them listened. Uh, I'd also like to thank that uh, my friends Sean and Sean, who have been kind of really encouraging me pushing yeah. me. Yeah. So, Sean, if you're listening, yes, I'm finally a legit designer now. <laughs> Yay! Yay. So, and well so, I just want to chime in real quick because <laughs> out of all of us that work at Hyper RPG, I probably play the most board games out of anyone. <laughs> okay. Board game nerd. Yeah, well, I'm a card game design winner. No, but we've seen like a lot. You know, we've seen like a lot of prototype and like test games. Like all the games you guys had were really freaking They're cool. Fun. Like, oh, and I was watching. I was like, man, that sounds fun. I want to play that. That sounds fun. I want to play that. That sounds fun too. So yeah, no, seriously, like, sure. good job. Like, no, thank you. And I was just, like, born like, I want to play those games. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, thank you, Joe. I think we're all winners here. It's such a privilege, I think, to be actually making games. It was such a pleasure to interview all you guys. We had a great time. Yes. Yeah, it was very fun. Yes, and thank you, Hyper RPG. You guys have been awesome. Awesome, and it's yeah. been so much fun. Um, and uh, say goodbye to the chat room. Hi. Say goodbye. Bye. I love Night. you guys. Bye. I just keep smiling. Yeah. Like, is this, is no, wait, idea? we just keep doing this? Like, for how long? I just do it. Until just keep going? I think they're just kind of hanging right. us out there. They're hanging You're us out right. to dry. Come on. <laughs> Are we done? Are we done?